we're a club that, that is used to winning silverware and we want to challenge for the title. That's it. We want to challenge. And, and to challenge, we know we have to improve a hell of a lot to what we were last year. Um, but, you know, we have a lot of belief in confidence that, um, you know, we can do that. So don't think that the result uh, makes me say that. Uh, regardless of the result, I, I believe in this group, uh, the staff that's come in, uh, from the chairman, CEO down, uh, we know what path we're on and we, what direction we, we're heading and uh, it's in the right direction. To challenge for the title you need a, a really strong squad. So um, you know, every player is important to us and that's why they've been brought in. Um, and you know, We anticipate us improving and getting better, which we will need to. Uh, but you know, we took a, a good step forward tonight and getting through to the next round is something we didn't do last year. So as a club we're delighted. Uh, playing groups delighted and uh, our fans will be very happy that you know they've got something to look forward to tomorrow. Yeah, well first half he, he was very tight, uh, second half he did well. I'd, I'd like to check when was the last time he played 75 minutes. I'd say it's almost two years. So you know to say that all of a sudden now he's a starter. Um, you know we, we've got to look after the boy as we have for the last 12 months. You know we want to help him build a foundation now that he can have a very good career. Because this boy has played six full games in the last five years. And that is not a, a player that can play every week. So we want to build the foundation that this boy who has a lot of talent can have a career for the next 10 years. So as a club we will look after him. Um, so we have to make sure that media and everyone we just keep uh, things in perspective. It was, uh, it was nice in front of those fans um, to be able to represent the West and, and um, putting that shirt on. It was a really good feeling. Yeah, look, the team did really well to build up the play and, and I saw Romeo lay it off for me and I took the opportunity and uh, went around the defender and scored. Um, and I was just really happy for, for the team that, you know, put in a good solid performance and uh, so early in pre-season as well. Um, we've got a lot to build on now and, and it's uh, moving ahead now. Keep our heads down and work hard and hopefully achieve more success. Every game's a, a new game and a new challenge, but uh, fantastic to get the win, uh, advance in the competition and uh, clean sheet as well. Yeah, there was a couple of little shaky situations, but then again, it's three and a half weeks into pre-season, so it was fantastic to, uh, like I said, get a clean sheet, get a win against the opposition that's been on the track uh, a good four weeks longer than us, so to run over them in the second half was really good. Yeah, it's good. I mean, like I was just saying, um, you know, I'm one of three goalkeepers at club and each week's a selection, so we're back on the track on Thursday and uh, working hard for the rest of the week. Yeah, uh, I'm very happy. Um, it's a bit different playing a right back tonight, but um, you know, it's good to get, get the win and um, you know, we start, start the season with a uh, victory. You've got to be happy with a clean sheet um, and to be fair, I don't think they had that many um, chances, so um, you know, pat on the back for the whole um, the whole team and um, in especially the block of six at the back there. Oh, look, I think um, you know Tony spoke about a, a winning mentality. So um, you know every game we take take each each uh, in the stride, and um, you know we, we've got to create that mentality, and um, we're taking it into the season and hopefully um, finishing you know, right up there.